Hi, this is Mike from the Mold Fanatics. Today I'm going to give you a quick demonstration of Gmail for the iPhone. Here we have the Gmail application right here. It's showing that I have two new messages. I'll go ahead and tap it, and here it is. Um, showing two new conversations. So if I wanted to go ahead and delete a conversation, I would just tap on the checkbox, and down at the bottom, I have some options. I could archive it, delete it. Click the arrow and you have a whole set of options right there. So I'll go ahead and trash it and it's gone. And right now I'll also test the push notification. So I'm sending an email from my computer from a different account. I just pushed send, it's been sent, so we'll see how long that takes to come through. In the meantime, we'll check out the menu. Um, it shows kind of like the left side of the Gmail interface on the computer. So as you go down the list, it's gonna show your labels, trash, and all your custom labels down below. Your sent mail can be viewed, starred, everything. Um, and next we'll check out the search. Oh, and you know what, I did compose, so we'll check out compose. So you can do two, it shows the um, I'm on my wife's iPhone right now, so it shows the contacts here from your phone. Um, you could do the BCC, CC, subject, and then down here is where you type your email. You could add an attachment from your phone. You could save it. It'll automatically save as well. Send it. Trash button to get rid of it. Discard your message. Oops, I push cancel. Yep, I want to discard. And we'll do a quick search. Let's search my email inbox for Amazon. See how quick it works? There it is. It was almost instantaneous, so the search is very fast. Back out of it. Um, I still haven't received the email that I sent to this account. So let me check it real quick on the computer, make sure it went through. Oh, there it goes, it just came through. 9, 10 p.m., it's 9, 11 right now, so didn't take too long. Check the email, go ahead and respond. The app is very quick. Um, whether or not you want to use it as your main Gmail app instead of the regular app is up to you. I would probably end up using this one instead of the uh, built-in email application on the iPhone. I could archive it from right here. Here's Again, here's the list of stuff you could do. I'll go ahead and archive it. And that should be it for the iPhone Gmail app demonstration on the iPhone 4. Thank you for watching.